there we go. Just had to manage that jump carefully and... Okay. All right, let's get up here before we get smashed. All right, go, 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 go. Ah! No, that's really terrible. Oh, but we're so close. That's what I mean. What if so many of these stories didn't need the best of the best kind of hero to come and be the one to to make the final jump? What if they just needed... Okay, careful. What if in so many of these stories, they just needed the last... Okay, let's see if we can find anything over here. Aha, there is something for the girl to grab. They just needed the last person to take the knowledge that other people had sacrificed for and be able to put it to use. I'm sure there's a few stories like that. Okay, yes, I know. We're trying to make that jump. I think we have to wait until we go way up. Got it. That momentum carries us. Because um, if... Uh, as they climbed to the top of the giant man, the girl realized what she must do. What must we do? Oh boy. Get his attention, maybe? If I could just steal his Adzi. Really? She thought. Oh, surely the blizzards would stop. How are we going to steal the weapon from him? But if we did. I mean, she's right. Then the blizzards would stop. Okay, there we go. I wonder if he even has a mine. A man made out of the ice. Okay. Oh, the fox spirit can only more or less watch at this stage, I think. Whew. Is she okay? I think so. All right, we've got to wait. Oh my gosh. Maybe there is no waiting. As soon as the wind picks up, we've got to make a jump for it. Like now. Okay. Oh, this chunk of ice is not going to be here very long. At all. Come on down, little climbing spirit. Hurry. Go up, up, up fast, little climbing spirit. This other chunk of ice, absolutely not going to be here very long. I thought I could jump on the Hadzi! <laughs> okay, I can jump on that chunk of it. I see, I see. Okay. Alright, jump for it! Alright, chunk of ice, not going to be here long. Not going to be here long. Let's get up. Thank you. Get down. Definitely time sensitive right now. Up we go. Okay, and then wait for it. Oh, she can't make that jump? Do we have to wait for the wind? Ah! But I know we're so close. Alright, alright, alright. Definitely one of those adrenaline pumping moments where you've committed and now you just have to carry through. I've had a few moments like that in my life. Okay, let's wait for a moment. Are we gonna get a good breeze? There. Oh, wait, give me the Atsi! Should I? Oh, there we go. There's something happening. Okay, now what do you want from me? Did she get it nice and stuck? Oh, I think... Okay, got it. Okay, hang in there. Alright, we have to get that next piece of ice. Okay, wait for it. Wait for it. I'm trying to get up in time so we can shoot that is going to be hard. Especially because she keeps getting blown back. 
I know, I know, I know. Come on. Okay, we're gonna have to wait. I have to get on the ground. Right on the very edge here. Ah! I keep being too impatient. He's gonna, like, get free any minute now if I'm not careful. Wait for it all the way. And then... Okay, there's that piece. Now where are we going? <laughs> the girl ran towards the giant Adzi. It broke loose and fell to the tundra floor. <gasps> the giant ran after the girl, but she was too fast. Oh my word, at least we managed to run from the other guy enough. The manhunter. That we learned how to dash away. Away he went with the Odzi, as a big man shoveled the snow, creating blizzard after blizzard. However, the big man soon saw, soon saw him as he grabbed the Odzi and ran off with it. Oh boy! Okay, so I guess we have it now. Oh, really? Now we're running from, from this guy too? Yes, I would very much like the breeze to help me out here. Uh, okay. How to, how to... Okay, come down, come down. Oh my gosh, how am I gonna make this work? Alright, help me out here, tree, please! How am I gonna make this work? What do I do now? Am I swimming? Oh my gosh. All right. All right. Okay. 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 Need help climbing. Okay. That's definitely happening. Okay. And then maybe... How is the tree going to help me now? I'm not sure. No, 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 no. Don't knock me into the water. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right, let's see what we can do here. Tree, please help. Okay, I think this gigantic blizzard coming up behind us is supposed to maybe give us a little bit of incentive to get moving. Okay, and then let's have the fox spirit. Definitely need him to move a little bit faster. Let's try to get all these pieces coming together for the girl. I can't get the pieces together. <laughs> Okay, okay, we're just gonna have to do our best here. Then what happens? How am I supposed to make it so that she's able to cross through without the blizzard coming for us? Okay. Oh, oh, that's so obvious. Oh, that's so painfully obvious. Now it's obvious. <laughs> I can't believe I needed that help. I can believe I needed that help though because it just confused the heck out of me. Come on, tree, up, up, up. Help me out here! I'm trying to help her! Can she reach it? Oh no, we didn't manage to reach it in time! Okay, free the trees and then manage to make their branches reach down. Got it, okay. And anything that looks like I can smack it with a bola, smack it with a bola. All right, come on tree. We've gotta work really quickly on this. Getting the tree to move fast is kind of hard. Okay, and then maybe I can pull this one over like this. And then maybe I can pull this down. Is that what I need to do? Please? Okay, definitely not helping there. Okay, maybe I need to pull this one up. So it's not in the girl's way. Okay, and then maybe this one closer. Can I get these branches closer at all? I can. Okay. All right, let's keep going. We're being blocked over here. She's gonna need to destroy this with her bola. All right. Oh my gosh. Having to outrun a blizzard like this on a, on a walking tree through a frozen forest seems extremely fitting for us. All right, I need the fox to stay with us in case he can help out. Look at the, the 
figures. Oh, wow. On those stilat or the, the icicles. Okay, do I need to move this guy or... No, 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 girl. We weren't done. We were doing so good. I think I absolutely have to move those trees out of the way is what's coming up next. All right. So I'm going to make sure that tree's out of the way. Good. She just needs to stay put. I need this tree to be out of the way, please. Okay. Maybe I don't. Maybe I need this tree to be over here. And this one to be down a little bit. So that she can safely jump. And now maybe up quite a bit. Yeah. Up, 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 up. Oh, could she still not make that jump? <laughs> okay, how many... Like, an entire village full of young girls would have had to come and more or less be sacrificed to this journey by now to make this happen on time. I'm trying my best. Little Fox Spirit is also trying their best, I think. Okay, let's see if we can get the tree to pull over here please. Okay. And then up as high as we can go, please. Can we go over anymore? Nope. Okay, good. Oh my gosh, is that all we needed to do? He threw down his shovel, climbed up from the flat tundra, and ran after. But the girl was too fast. Oh, here. Here we go. Oh, not here again! Okay, who are we as? Okay, we're as the girl. Okay, trying to run. Okay, this time I might need some help. Okay. No, 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 I got it, I got it. So he doesn't run fast, but he does run. Okay, wait. Okay, go with the wind. Okay, she's gonna have to keep moving. Are we gonna have to retrace our way all the way back home? She is carrying his Odzi! Where's Azu? Or Aze, yeah. Meanwhile, the spirits are out and about as extra danger. Okay. Hey, back off! No! How'd they grab her? No, they grabbed the spirit! Oh, they can grab the spirit boy now! Oh, dear! Okay, okay. Alright, working together is going to be a little bit hard for these two. Watch out for that guy. Would prefer if we do not get yoinked by him. So let's get a move on. All right, come on, 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 come on. Dodge, 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 dodge. Both of you dodge. <laughs> and the Blizzard Man was here. Oh, they both got taken. I, I mean, I hate the idea of it, but I actually feel like I have a story idea coming on that like maybe only a child could oh we got taken again i really have to watch out for those things like what if there is some sort of terrible terrible oh my gosh terrible and horrible mixed together is terrible apparently but what if there's some sort of like key to breaking a terrible legacy that these two are trying to escape and it requires Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. A child to, like, be the hero with the final key. Okay, go, 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 go. Off he had run with the Odzi in his hand. The big man chased him without catching him. Okay, we'd very much prefer to keep running. But I just have this idea of what if a child was required for the final key. And that's where, like, these child sacrifices came from. Is that they just had to keep throwing kids at the problem until it was finally over. Until the one child finally managed to, like, get the key where it was supposed to go. That would be horrible, but it would be a powerful story. Alright, let's go. The fish spirits are trying to help. I wonder, well, are they helping or are they just kind of reacting? And, ooh! What the heck? And the fox spirit is the one making this all happen. Okay. What if all the other spirits are just being pushed around 
unknowingly like elementals that they are. Okay, go, 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 go. Don't get smushed, don't get smushed. So we have to watch out for the movement of tides. Keep moving. I hear the whale. Is that the ice whale? Oh, that's the polar bear. Are you kidding me? Whoops, bulla bulla bulla. Get out of here, bear. I really don't have time for you. What? I really don't have time for you, but how am I gonna make that jump? Okay, all right, we've got this. Like, legitimately not the time to run into you, bear. Oh my gosh. Okay, and then with the wind behind us and the bear in front of us. Am I going to end up riding her back? Oh my word. That was going to be a little bit much. Maybe the bear realized, like, maybe I don't want to be in this situation at the moment. All right, there we go. Okay, so the bear is leaving us alone. The girl made it back to her village. The blizzard man was not far behind. The blizzard man bellowed, Give me back my Odzi. The girl struck the Odzi on a rock. to ruin the edge of its blade. And threw it up to the giant man. He was so happy he burst out laughing and began to sing. Who chipped off the who chipped the blade off my Odzi? So that tomorrow when you go outside you will see caribou feet. Uh -huh. If there's such a blizzard you can't see the prints to follow the caribou. The girl was reunited with her family. Aww. I wonder if she has the story of some sort of uh, of like a, a ancestor who was quite clever like that and is carrying on a little bit of their soul. The big man had seen his Odzi being tossed up and out the skylight. Because this made him so happy, he burst out laughing. The fox said to the girl, if you ever need to find your way home again, just look up for me. And floated up through the night sky. I have heard Nasruk tell the story that way. Oh, here we go, you guys. Thank you very, very much for following me along on our journey in Never Alone. Rumor has it that there is another story coming at some point in the future that I would be very excited to look forward to. And there is another tale, a fox tale, that we might explore here as well sometime soon. But I'm really happy that we went on this adventure into the cold of Never Alone. And we learned so much about, for me, what was a very different culture. Like I said, my family is Hawaiian and German. 
<laughs> mostly Hawaiian, and the idea of, of being somewhere with so much snow is very foreign to any of our family myths, for sure. <laughs> and I loved it. I really loved it. And I loved being able just to be wrapped up in this cold, blustery world and think about the stories that could be forming outside instead of just how cold it is out. And I can't wait to share more adventures with all of you. So if you would like to join us on this and literally thousands more adventures, do please consider subscribing. But otherwise, my friends, stay curious, and I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye!